Hey everybody! Maurizio here again with another edition of Let's Draw. Today, I wanted to try something a little different. We're going to be drawing a dog, but this time he's going to be wearing some cool clothes and he's going to be saying hi to a bird flying by. So this is more of like a scene kind of thing, but it's still going to be really easy to follow and I hope you enjoy it. So let's begin. All right, as always, I like to put down my shapes and where things are going to be first before I start drawing the details. So let's first start with our dog. We're going to draw his head in. Roughly just shape out where it's going to be. And this is his torso, his body over here. This dog, as you can see so far, is standing on two legs. Sometimes I draw webkins on four legs, sometimes on two. They can do either, either or. So let's put his arm up here. So let's draw in his leg. And we're putting it forward because he's going to be walking. So we want to show his legs kind of bending. There we go. And now this dog's going to have, he's going to be based off the Golden Retriever. So the Golden Retriever has long ears. We're going to fill them in here. And then I'm just going to put this line here to show where the center of his face is going to be. And I like to do the torso as well. All right. So we got the dog here. Now I'm going to put in the bird that he's going to be saying hi to. Now Webkin's birds are a little bit smaller than regular Webkin's. So we're going to draw his head. That's his head right there where it's going to be. And a little torso. Now we're going to figure out where his wings are going to be. So as you can guess, this bird is flying in the air. So remember, no details yet. You're just putting in the shapes. The details we're going to do in a moment. And then we're going to put his feet over here. So once you figure out where all your shapes are going to be and where you're going to draw in the details, we are good to go with starting to drawing the fun stuff. So get your marker, and now let's really start having fun. All right, so I'm gonna start first with his eyes. One, two black beady eyes. His nose. Then we're gonna draw a little smile like that. And I wanna give him an open mouth again because he's saying hello to the bird. Now, before I draw the ears, I think I'm going to draw the head so I can carefully figure out where the shapes are going to be. That's good. Give him a little bit of a cheek here. Like so. Now I'm going to put the ear over the cheek. And then I'm going to erase this piece like that. And then the other ears just a little bit behind, like so. As I said before, we're going to put clothes on this dog. So I'm not going to draw the body part. You have to put the clothes over and then you got to race more than you need to. Especially with marker, you won't be able to do that. So we're going to do a nice, cute t-shirt. That's the sleeve. And then we're going to do a little part where the head goes in. The t-shirt, I think, should end about here. I think that's a good spot for the dog's waistline. Just like that. And then we're going to draw the other sleeve just right there. Okay. So before I want to work on the bottom part, I'm going to finish drawing his body. So we got the arms. And then we're going to do paws. Three little shapes like that. I'm going to draw his arm. In his other hand, waving hello. And because this is the inside of his hand, we're going to draw a little line over here. Perfect. Okay, so let's give this doggy some pants. I think we're going to give him a pair of jeans. We're going to do long pant legs, like so. Draw the other side. 
And now, let's give him some running shoes because he is out going for a walk and we want to make sure that he's comfortable through these little shapes. Maybe just put like a little circle here for the running shoe design and then little squiggly lines for shoelaces. And then we're going to do the same thing for this side. And this part, this little line I'm doing here is just the rubber sole that you find under running shoes. There we go. All right, so before we get on to the bird, what you can do, and you don't have to do this, this is extra, but I always like to do this, we can put little details um, on the clothes. So I'm gonna put little lines over here for the bottom of his jeans. Maybe give him a little, little pocket line over here. And then you can have fun and you can do, again, I always like to encourage designs and stuff. You can either go to the Kin Style Outlet and look at Webkin's clothes there, or you can do your own designs. Nice little heart there. And that's it for the dog. So let's draw his little friend be saying hi to. So the, the way to draw a bird is it's almost, the eyes are definitely the same. Two little beady eyes. Now the mouth, you're gonna have to practice on a bit because he's got a beak. So we're gonna do, it's almost like a little triangle. And you wanna make it open. It looks like he's smiling. And then a little head, you can do a circle. You can do some shape, you can do a shape like that. Now the wings, the wings are gonna take a little bit of practice, but I know you can do it because I'm gonna show you how. Do a line, and then you do shapes like this. These are the feathers. It's one. I've drawn these wings a lot. So don't be discouraged if you don't get it right the first or second time. Because I draw a lot of webkins every day. It took a lot of practice to be able to draw the pets. All right, so we got the wings. He looks happy to me so far. I don't know about you guys, but I think this bird looks happy and the dog looks happy. So let's finish him right here. Let's do the feet. So we do three little spiky shapes for the feet. They almost look like tulips, don't they? And then his body, right around there. And the, the, the tail you can do many different ways. For here, I think I'm gonna give him three feathers at the end. So one, two, three, and there we go. And then if you wanna add some little details later, you can draw some grass. Grass, usually I draw just little spikes, different shapes. Grass is easy and fun to do because it's just random little spikes, and no matter which way you do it, it always looks nice. So now that we're done, if you had this with pencil, you could erase the, the lines you did to figure out the shapes. Or in this case, I'm just gonna make them disappear like that. And we have our clean picture. And there we go. We got our dog, just bought his clothes at the Kinstall outlet, and he's showing it off to his little bird friend flying by. Everyone, thank you again for joining me. I really hope you're enjoying these videos. I've been reading all your comments and it seems like you guys are having a great time with them. So I will be back and keep on doing more. And I hope it's helping everybody out there fine tune their drawing skills because drawing is fun and I encourage everybody to do it. So thanks again for joining me and I'll see you next time. Click to play Webkins or watch more videos.